Welcome back sa ating FB page na free reviewers managed by Leonalyn at sa ating YouTube channel na Solving Math with Leonalyn. Now, let's answer questions from random post. Dalawa, tatlo pa lang klase ito. Uh, ito ay pariho lang, tapos meron pang mga ganito. Ito muna ang unahin natin, yung old value, tapos new value. Find the percent increase or decrease. Number one. Unang-una mong gagawin, kunin mo lang ang difference. Paano kunin yung difference? Bigger number minus smaller number. This is 36. At ang pang-divide natin dito sa 36, yung old value, which is also 36. 36 divided by 36 and that is 1. Tapos i-convert natin to percent. So, dagdagan mo lang ng dalawang zero or mag-move ka ng decimal twice to the right side at lagyan ng percent sign. So, therefore, ang sagot dito sa number one ay 100%. Next, number two. Kunin ulit yung mismong difference nila from larger number minus yung smaller number and that is five. Yung pang-divide, yun yung old value, yung pang-divide natin sa five which is 15. 5 over 15, and this is 0.33, never-ending siya na 3. Ngayon, kung i-convert natin to percent, mag-move lang tayo twice to the right side, so therefore, this is 33.33 percent. Yan na yung sagot sa number 2. Again, ang old value ay 1,000, yung new value ay 3,000. Kunin mo lang yung difference. So, ang difference dito ay 2,000. Yung pang-divide natin sa 2,000 or yung gawin nating denominator ay yung old value. This is 1,000. Para mas madali, mayroon tayong tatlong zero sa taas, tatlong zero sa baba. 2 lang din naman yan over 1. So, this is 2. Now, kung i-convert natin to percent, Dagdagan mo lang ng dalawang zero at lagyan ng percent sign. So, sa number three, this is 200 percent. X. Ganun pa rin ang gagawin natin. Kunin yung mismong difference. Ang difference dito ay 250. At i-divide natin sa mismong old value which is 500. Next, 250 divided by 5. 500 or since itong half sa 500 ay 250, this is 0.5. Now, sa percent naman, i-move lang natin itong decimal going to the right side twice to 1, 2. Yung space lagyan ng 0 at lagyan natin ng percent sign. So, therefore, dito sa number 4, this is 50%. Next, number 5. Yung difference ulit. This is... 150. 250 ba? Minus 100. 150. Yung pang-divide natin, laging yung old value na 100. So, 150 divided by 100, and this is 1.5. In other words, ganito na lang. 150 per 100 means 150 percent. Laging tandaan, percent means Per 100. Next, dito tayo sa number 6. Ang old value. Mas malaki na sa new value. Ganun pa rin ang gagawin natin. Kukunin natin yung difference. Ang difference dito ay 75. At ganun pa rin. Yung pang-divide natin ay yung old value na 150. 75 divided by 150, or since half lang din naman yan siya, this is 0.5. Otherwise, this is 50% decrease. Okay? Next, kunin ulit natin yung difference. Ang difference dito ay ilan ba to? 30. At yung pang-divide natin ay yung old value, which is 45. 30 divided by 45, kayo na mag-divide nito. This is 0.66, never ending na 0.666. Apat na lang ang gagawin natin. So, kung i-convert natin to percent, 
Mag-move lang tayo twice itong decimal to the right side at lagyan ng percent sign. So, therefore, this is 66.67%. Next, number 8. Ganun pa rin. Yung difference ay 90. Yung pang-divide, yung old value na 100. Ngayon, no need na tayong mag-divide, divide. Anyway, this is 90 per 100. Means 90 per cent. 90 per 100. So, therefore, this is 90 per cent. Next, sa number 9. Kunin ulit yung difference. Ang difference ay 188. Yung pang-divide natin yung old value na 12. 188 divided by 12. This is 15.666 na never-ending na 6. Tapos, kung i-convert natin to percent, again, mag-move lang tayo ng decimal twice to the right side at lagyan ng percent sign. Kaya ito ay uh, 15, tapos yung 66.67 percent. Next, ang difference ulit ay 7. Yung old value, yan yung pang-divide. 7 divided by 10, or this is 0.7. Kung i-convert sa percent na may percent sign, i-move lang natin twice to the right side, yung space, lagyan ng 0, at lagyan natin ng percent sign. So, therefore, this is 70%. Ngayon, ito yung abangan nyo sa next na video, yung word problems, na same lang din na ganito. So, abangan nyo ito sa next na video. Thank you and God bless.